morning guys it is Wednesday uh, Chris is very very sick so we had a pretty rough night last night um, my f car is doing something weird I'm on my way to work now I've already dropped off the baby with his grandmother um, and I'm just hoping that today is a nice smooth day we can get through it and get home I don't know what Chris's schedule is but he went in super early so I have a feeling he's off by like three or four o'clock um, I'm hoping at least so we'll find that out later today um, hopefully I get home in a decent time I don't know if I'll end up working late today I worked a little bit late yesterday just because I missed Monday because I was so sick so I'm hoping that I won't be there super late today and I'll get off at a normal time by the way I got the new Taylor Swift CD 1989 and I just want to say that um, I cannot stop listening to that CD. It's ridiculously good. So if you guys haven't got it, definitely go get it. It's completely different than every other CD she's ever put out. It's, you know, pretty much pure pop instead of like a, more of a country album. Um, but it's really, really good. Like it's hard to not like this album. It's really hard to not like it. It's addicting. Even Chris likes it. All right, guys. We are on our way home. I've already picked up Aiden. Um, <clears throat> Chris is there already, but he's still really not feeling good, so I don't really know what we're going to be doing tonight. I'm sorry there hasn't really been much of any uh, videos or vlogs, rather, the past couple days, but we've just all been sick and kind of passing it around, and it's just been a very tiring couple days, right? How wow. Well? Anyways, we're on our way home now. Um, I don't know if I'll be making anything for dinner because I don't know how much Chris would actually eat at this point. Um, so yeah, I'm not really sure what we're going to do with all of that. But I suppose we'll figure something out. Maybe soup or noodles or something like that. My phone is dying, so I might not have much time um, to say anything before I get home and can plug it in. But um, I'm sorry I didn't vlog this morning. I filmed something of Aiden, but I didn't actually say hello because I forgot to afterwards. Um, but I'm on my way home now. It's 4.30. Chris got off at 4, so we both get to be home together tonight, which is awesome. I'm not used to him being home with me because I got used to Halloween Horror Nights where he was pretty much always working. So it's nice to have him home with me. Um, and tomorrow's Friday, which is awesome because we get paid. And let's be honest, everybody likes to get paid. So that'll be a good day tomorrow. Um, I think I have some stuff planned with mom this weekend, so it should actually be a pretty exciting weekend for the vlog, which is good because the videos have been so short lately and kind of boring because I haven't been doing anything. I'm a mom and a wife and I work full time and that often takes up most if not all of my time just because it's a full time job and I have a full time job. A lot of it's not very exciting for you guys because it's domestic life and it's not the most exciting thing in the world that's unfortunate but I think we have some cool stuff planned this weekend I'm not gonna say anything right now because I kind of want it to be a surprise for the vlog but I think it'll be fun and I think it'll make for good vlogs and I think you guys will enjoy it and I'm stopped right next to people and I think they're all staring at me because I'm talking into my phone But I'm just gonna continue to do it because who gives a shit right right I suppose I guess until one of them is somebody that I work with because I'm right next to my work. And then they are like, oh, well I saw you yesterday in your car talking to your phone. That could be a really awkward situation. And it would have looked more awkward if I was laughing at myself. Probably. Oh yeah, I straightened my hair today. That's uh, doesn't happen often. People are honking. <sighs> Today is a decent day. It was a good day at work. I was busy. I got to see my best friend because she was working with another company and was at the area that I work at, or at the hospital that I work at working there. So I got to have lunch with her, which is pretty cool. And um, yeah, so it's been a pretty good day. I'm 
ready to go home though. I am tired. And I need to start going to bed at a normal time. I went to bed at almost one o'clock in the morning last night and then I had to turn around and get up at seven, which is stupid. I gotta stop doing that. I'm like killing myself, burning the candle at both ends. But Aiden wouldn't go to bed because he took a nap earlier in the day and then wasn't tired. So I was kind of stuck being awake with him. Um, but yeah, I gotta knock that off too. He can't be taking naps in the middle of the day anymore. Here's just Jay Shock on my right there. Are you in here? You are, just let me know. We're gonna be here all night. And you were killed by her. I wonder how many times he sat here and looked out this window. Kirk would take the bodies right and drag them out right there. The woods. These woods are Chris has a parrot in the form of a kitty. What he would find would be the scene of one of the most horrific murders in Savannah's history.